Thank you, Got the Scoop. I love you. We got Got the Scoop in here. Like, oh, it is vibey. What up, guys? It's your girl Shay from Got the Scoop, and we're about to get into your girl Cardi B and JT from the City Girls going at it. Make sure you smash the like button. Make sure you turn on the notifications. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can stay in the loop of Got the Scoop and you'll miss none of our videos. Okay, okay. Now let's go. So earlier, your girl JT responded to a troll page that was basically hating on the troll page name is JT Hate Page, and basically was coming at JT was saying like, how does it feel like you know she collab with Nicki Minaj and Cardi B song with Lil Willa is doing better than hers basically anyway she responded and while she responded she congratulated Glorilla because Glorilla's song hit number nine on the top 10 of the billboards okay your girl Cardi B just came out of nowhere and wrote lap dog this came after JT responded to Cardi B's fan page that wrote Girl, this one tickled you, not congrats, Glow. You know you can't mention Cardi or your master is gonna get the whip. JT responded and said, nah, actually, the tweet was too long. Plus, Cardi been having top 10, so I've been congratulating her for years. This is Glow's first one. I've been ignoring y'all, but y'all are hella annoying. Move around, get off my dick, thank you. JT followed up with a tweet and said, I hope you don't think you no bully, we ain't a dog. And then responded to somebody that said, not you been waiting. Waiting on what exactly? I literally bother no one. Fuck out of here. Move for real. Cardi B wrote fetch and JT responded. She said, Cardi, you go fetch a real talent. We DM and why you come back here to put on a show for these kids? Cardi B responded and said, so wait, me and you talking in a DM woman to woman, but you take it to your timeline and throw shots calling me a bully and a wiener? Why are you playing dumb? And you talking about a talent? Ha, forgot P tried to put me on with your writer. Okay, before I continue on. Cardi B, we not gonna do this shit, girl. You subbed her first. Timelines do not motherfucking lie, okay? Like, come on. JC said, no, you want an hour written. I think she said, you're right. She said, for an hour hooks, for an hour sound, because you clearly have none. Ask any writer. I write my own shit. You know this. That was before you replied and said you was talking about me. So tell the world why you said I'm a lapdog, Cardi. JC also wrote, Wait, I'm back for this last week because who doing anything for doggy treats? If anything, Lorilla gave you a bone that you needed to go feed that dog you was posing by by the pool for hot shit, fancy pants. Cardi B wrote, I definitely didn't. P wanted to put me into your writers because y'all numbers make him pennies. My talent speaks for itself, though. She also followed up and said, you know what? The DMs are getting more personal and it's way beyond this shit. I'm going to stop it right here. Twitter, you're welcome for the show. Cardi followed up and said, how shit debuted higher than any song you ever dropped or been on? Prison Pants. Everybody has good and bad moments. You haven't had one since what? Act up? JT said, I'm a street bitch. YouTube ain't got me on no leash. Home move. Maybe both our time is off, but how am I opportunist? You call me a lap door for no fucking reason. Makes sense, but back to the DMs I go. Okay, let me weigh in and let me tell you what I think. I feel like Cardi B, she out here starting shit. She's throwing rocks and hot in her hands like I told her before. So she started using that inside her vocabulary. Because Cardi B, you over there saying lap dog. And then when she responded, you pulled up in her DM and said, yeah, you was talking about her. So how you come on social media, throw shots first because nobody congratulated you. Did you congratulate her for anything she done? Like besides the new Nicki Minaj queen mix, because of course you ain't going to congratulate her. Anything JT been incorporated, have you motherfucking congratulated her with Summer Walker, with her in Young Miami, period. Like, you don't be congratulating her, so don't be trying to act like she's supposed to just jump out and come down to your pedestal. You really mad because you thought you had the city girls against Nicki Minaj. You had them at a moment, but you didn't really have no dibs on JT. It was more Young Miami because JT was doing her time. Now you see it's a relationship. You out here picking with all the girls. Why are you picking with Akbar? You picking with Akbar like Akbar is not the reason how you and Cal from the neighborhood talk. It's fucking cool with each other. You are mad because of what? You really out here acting like Glorilla's song is your song, okay? Tomorrow, too? That's Glorilla's song. That's not your song. Because at the end of the day, how you started with Akbar? Because she said something about the charts. Because you know y'all had your teens out here paying blogs to post fake stacks. So you mad because somebody said something? Like, Glorilla's not even able to enjoy her moment because Cardi B's doing so much. Now today, 
JT, she ended up congratulating Glorilla. Like, what the fuck? You want her to congratulate you too? Bitch, you gotta you gotta receive the same energy that you put out. You don't fuck with me like that, I ain't gonna fuck with you like that. But then you out here subbing, and then when a person catch the sub and throw they shit, you wanna pull up in a DM, and then you wanna keep it to the DM, then come back to social media. You did that to everybody. Aqua, Milan, Christopher, JT, everybody you have problems with. You talk that shit, but then talking shit inside the DM. Pick one, pick one, like really. Like everybody will be quick to say Nicki Minaj is problematic, but Cardi B is problematic because out of nowhere you have all these problems with all these girls that's obviously on the song with Nicki Minaj and it's so real, real, real bitter. You want people to only fuck with you. That's how you could tell like Cardi B, she's the one who make you sigh and pick and choose. If you fuck with me, you can't fuck with that type of person. Because why are you throwing shots at JT? Because it's really starting to make me think that that rumor's true. Like did Uzi really drag or set out the spot or what because definitely seem like it's smoke guys let me know what you think in the comments below do you think cardi b is out here starting shit but the blogs and the news outlets is not plastering it out there like they would do with anybody else do you think it's a coincidence that it's like she's going at every single person that just collaborated with Nicki minaj on the queen mix like it's getting sketchy and you guys stop being scared to comment in the goddamn comment because there's a whole bunch of views on the videos but y'all really be ghosting the goddamn comments like y'all scared y'all think i bite but nah let me know what you guys think in the comments below thank you guys for fucking with me because i fuck with y'all and until next time, bye. I got the two.